Dear student, this is question number seven. S. C. Verma, chapter number two. This is very interesting question. A spy report about suspended car follows. The car moved two kilometers towards east. Let's see, car is moving two kilometers towards east, and take a left turn, perpendicular turn, having five hundred meters. Five hundred meter, I can write zero point five kilometer. Now take a right perpendicular turn, having four kilometer path left. Now you need to calculate the displacement. Let x is the displacement. Now I am using vector technique in order to solve it. Calculate x vector. I have to divide it by this way. This is i unit vector, and this is j unit vector. And here I will take k unit vector. Let's see. First of all, you see the diagram. Car moved two kilometer towards east. It means east means here I. That is, I can write here two I plus zero point five kilometer towards y axis. It means zero point five into j unit vector plus. Four kilometer towards this again. That means along x-axis. That's why I can write four i. And when you solve it, it will be four plus two six i plus zero point five g. This is the value of x vector displacement vector. Now, if you want to calculate the magnitude of displacement vector, it will be under root of six. Square plus zero point five square, and it will be thirty six plus zero point two five. Finally, you can write thirty six point two five, and you solve it approximately six point zero two kilometers. Is the Displacement covered by the stick. Now, in second part, as a displacement is a vector quantity, you need to calculate the direction. You can calculate the direction by drawing this diagram by this way. You know, here it is zero point five, and it will be part of two. One is two kilometers, plus another is this value is parallel to. This value when you draw this way, that will be four. Two plus four is six. Now you can write this is suppose that alpha, and tan alpha can be written as zero point five upon six. Alpha can be written as tan inverse of five sixty. That is one upon twelve. This will be the answer. In order to get fresh lecture in future, please subscribe my channel.